at 6.01 this morning. We continue to follow that crane collapse in Norwood. So just look behind my shoulder yeah. here. This is Sky Ranger video over the scene yesterday. It happened around noon. The crane is still there this morning, as you can imagine. A ton of equipment now being brought in to get this cleared. Yeah. Mary Marcos is actually live at the scene. So Mary, talk to us about what happened. Well, we still don't know how this happened, but we know that crews were to use two cranes to remove the boom from the roof. The body, as you can see, see is still on scene here. It is now uprighted. But when the crane tipped over around 1230 yesterday afternoon, the boom came crashing down onto this Norwood condo building. Investigators say the crane operator was able to get out on his own and none of the residents were injured. Two of the Eaton Village condos here on Neponson Street are damaged. Building inspectors were on scene yesterday working to determine which units are safe to live in. Residents say the roof has been under construction for months and the project was just about wrapping up. Kavita Patel was home when the crane toppled over. I live two doors down from the from the unit that was impacted. Um, all I could hear was like a like a giant earthquake. I was just shocked because they spent so much money on updating the roofs and now they're going to have to go back and, and do it again. Now, as I mentioned, it's still not exactly clear how this happened, but OSHA is investigating the cause of the crash. Live in Norwood, Mary Marcos, NBC10 Boston.